from Singapore, guys. By the background, you could be forgiven for thinking I'm somewhere else, but not. I'm in Singapore, just landed. Come down here to the Arab Quarter. Gonna uh, indulge myself in some nice Lebanese cuisine and uh, just been sussing out the masjid. Looking good in the late afternoon light. Unfortunately, it's starting to rain a little bit, but anyway, we'll uh, deal with it. Let's go for a wander. And um, I've headed straight here to the Arab Quarter for all my Iraqi and Arabic speaker subscribers. Thank you for watching. Let's go for a wander. And this here is the Sultan Masjid. Looking beautiful in the late afternoon light. Hi. Hello. Hi. So as you can imagine, you can find all kinds of food here. All kinds of Arabic food, Indian food, Islamic dress. So we're here in Arab Street. Cute little street. Lots of textiles. Hopefully we come across some nice Middle Eastern food. I'm really looking forward to that. Beautifully coloured buildings up ahead. There's Muscat Street. really feel like I'm in the heart of the Middle East with the Chinese influence. Hmm, coffee shop. A bit late for coffee, maybe tomorrow. Got some Turkish baklava and kanefa. Probably a little bit early, we're just on dusk, which is why it's uh, raining. Often these places rain at this time of day. In the tropics, you get that. Hummus and tendo. Really nice area, right? Lots to eat. Kampong Glam. There it is. Well, this is definitely where you come for your Middle Eastern fix. There's no doubt about that. Hello. Definitely. For sure. For sure. And I'm ready. Been indulging in lots of Vietnamese in Vietnam. But it's time to... Uh, have some Lebanese slash Turkish. Hi. This place is popular, Hi, Sophia. Beautiful decor, look at that. Hello. Nice, good job. Masjid Sultan, beautiful. Pretty much all the restaurants have a Turkish or a Lebanese theme. Looks pretty good. Looks good. Thank you. Hello ladies. Nice area. Very nice area. I've been to Singapore many times and I've never been here before. I didn't know this existed. How's that possible? All the foods kind of similar. It's definitely all got a very Turkish theme. Merhaba. Nasılsın? İyiyim, sağ nasılsın? Teşekkür ederim. Çok güzel. Çok güzel, 
अरे मैम यहाँ पे नहीं मिलेगा All right, so I've chosen to uh, eat something at Tabule. Um, it's got the best ratings around, so better be good. Uh, let's suss it out. Menu. It's halal. Got some salads, some breads, meza, hot meza, hmm, falafel, manakish. Oh, that looks good, doesn't it? That does look good. Mashawi. Mixed grill. Alright, so my dishes have arrived. Let's see what I've got. Manakish. Cheese pizza, basically. A little bit of salad on top. And some lovely lamb and hummus. Some bread on the side. Let's hook in. Alright guys, so we've got a nice bit of bread here. Let's get some of this hummus. Delicious, look at that. Hummus and lamb. It's a cold mesa. Lamb is cold. Um, tender. Hummus is creamy. Very nice. Get a bit more meat. Maybe I don't know to spell, right? It's <laughs> a nice piece. You know, I've been to uh, Singapore many times and I know Singapore has a lot of districts, a lot of areas. But I didn't realize it had such a vibrant Arab quarter. I'll be missing out. All right, let's try this uh, cheese pizza. nice cheese. Crispy. Base is cooked. <laughs> Very nice. Well guys, that was a pretty delicious uh, light meal I just had. Uh, quite bready and cheesy, but still very nice. Uh, 44 Singapore dollars that cost me with a Coke. So not too bad for um, a good quality foreign cuisine here in Singapore. But again, who would have known this was Singapore, huh? I certainly didn't know. Look at this, it looks beautiful tonight too. It's not too busy, which is good. And uh, just loving the vibes down here. Singapore, this does not look like your typical Singaporean street, does it? Not at all. Not what you think when you come to Singapore. But this little Arab quarter is a real little gem tucked away in the back streets here in Kampong Glam. When you're in town, come down, try yourself some Arab cuisine, a lot of Turkish restaurants here too. And uh, check out the mosque. Looks beautiful at blue hour. Yeah. Who would have thought? This is Singapore. Really? Come on. Awesome. Another beautiful day on planet Earth.
Haji Tawakal. Carpets. Hello. Hello. Hello. Where are you from? I'm from Iran. Iran. Whoa. Nice. How are you? I'm good, thank you, sir. Nice carpets. Welcome. Thank you. He's got plenty of carpets. You know, Iran's home of the carpet. Many carpets. Carpets galore. Beautiful. Look at all these. And as we learnt from our Turkish video, when we bought, bought a Turkey, Turkish carpet in Gurame, different patterns and motifs come from different areas. They have a story within the carpet. It's not just a pretty design, it's deeper than that. It has meaning and philosophy behind it. It has culture and destination. Carpets are a memento of a place that you visited or can be just something you hold special in your heart but um, definitely carpets are more than rugs and Iran is one of the home of the carpet true thank you thank you yes, you're yes. welcome which city are you from nice to meet you, you I'm too. From Te near Tehran near Tehran yeah. okay and how long have you been in Singapore I am almost 10 years here. 10 years now did you come here as a refugee or no no no, you just immigrated yes, yes. with your family, your wife, no, children. My family there. Oh, they're back in Iran yes. still. Why don't they come? Because here is for them a school is difficult. Oh, really? A school very expensive. School, everything's expensive yeah, in Singapore, school, right? Yes. Much more expensive than Iran. Yes, of course. Do you go back to Iran every year? I go once a year. Yeah, once a year. Nice, very nice. What's your name? Mohammed. Mohammed. Thank you, Mohammed. Thank you so much. Thank beautiful, beautiful thank carpets. You, thank you. You are most welcome. Thank, thank you. you. Thank you. Bye bye. Look at this shop. This looks great. Saravan's carpets. Also carpets, but also lighting. Look at these lamps. All from Turkey. Turkey. Beautiful. Very common all over the Balkans and Turkey. That's a great looking shop. Beautiful. Oh, some nice uh, Iznik tile ceramic ware there too. Beautiful. It's great when you come into places like this. So photogenic. So beautiful. Hello, where Hello. are you from? Are you, are you from Turkey? I am from Afghanistan. Afghanistan. Oh, yes. assalamu alaikum. Alaikum ah, Nice. Thank you. Awesome. Uh, when did you come to Singapore? How many years ago? Most nearly 15 years. 15 years ago. Yes. Oh, okay. How do you think about Afghanistan today? Is it okay? Okay, not bad. Yeah, yeah. I'm hoping to go soon. I hope we'll get better. Yeah, hopefully, inshallah. Yeah, huh? inshallah, inshallah. Yes, I hope so. Nice shop. Thank you. Where are you from? New Zealand. Welcome to Singapore. Oh, thank you. I like this area, Arab thank Quarter. You. and Yeah, yeah I'm just talking to Tawakal over there, yeah, yeah, Iranian okay. guy, and yeah. you're Afghanistan. Nice. Yeah, yeah. Thank you. International, United yeah, yeah. Nations. That is also our shop. It's also your yes. shop. <laughs> nice. Thank you. Very nice. Thank Who would have thought? This is Singapore. This doesn't seem like Singapore. Yes, correct. Singapore is finance and modern and tall buildings and. Yeah, all in one. All in one. Yeah, Stir fry, yeah. noodles. Yeah. You can see this area is all like Middle East. Yes. If you go Orchard Road, it's more like Europe. Yes. You go Chinatown, like China. China, yeah. Yeah, and you go Little India, like India, Bangladesh, Pakistan. Fantastic, yeah. yeah? It's good. really good. Yeah. Really you. exciting. Yeah, love it. I love it when I come to these places. So interesting. The culture is so amazing. Have a great time talking to the local people here made a new life for themselves uh, really really inspiring fantastic thank you You're welcome. Um, what's your name Faizullah Faizullah yes. and uh, which city in Afghanistan are you from originally we are from Kandahar but my family migrated to Pakistan oh okay right now my family is living in Pakistan Quetta in Quetta yes. oh, okay nice all thank right Quetta is big city uh, it's almost like Singapore 
Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah quite big, yeah? yeah. But Singapore is too small. <laughs> <laughs> Singapore is interesting, especially when you can find places like yes, this. Correct. Yeah, anyway, so nice to meet you Thank and you. Uh, nice to meet you too. Uh, good luck with your business. Hopefully, Thank tourists you. come back and you can make money yeah, again. I hope so. Thank you. Okay, bye bye. Wish you good luck. Bye bye. Bye bye. So, nicely done. Some of these streets are just pedestrian, so it's really nice just to walk around. Uh, lots of eateries, a lot of Middle Eastern Turkish eateries. Uh, as you saw, some carpet shops, some lamp shops really friendly locals and look where we are Baghdad Street a place close to my heart missing you Iraq maybe I'll be back before long inshallah all right so it started raining again which is not good I think I'm gonna uh, call it a night and head on back to the hotel it's a bit of a shame. It's really lovely here. Really enjoying these vibes. It's always nice to step out from one culture and country into another directly. You know, it's not like you didn't go home in between. So um, it really aids in your experience while you're abroad when you just jump from country to country. So, all right guys, so that's a wrap. Let's head back to the hotel. Oh, that's a nice picture. Love these curved daggers. Let's head back to the hotel and uh, get some rest. We got to do it all again tomorrow and a bit more. Singapore, loving you. <laughs>